addition to new varieties, we also wanted to answer a couple questions that we've received on our website. Susan from New York asked, why are my hydrangeas not blooming? This is a great question that we hear all the time, so we've developed a fantastic resource called Hydrangeas Demystified. Not only do we have a page on our website, we've also created a sign you can display within your hydrangeas section. Jill from Ontario wrote, while we survived 2020 and we love our neighbors, we'd like to have some additional privacy since we're spending so much more time outside. Do you have any shrub recommendations for creating a living screen? Hedges are some of the hardest working plants in the garden, fulfilling the important role of providing privacy and enclosure. Stonehedge Skinny Taxis has a super columnar habit that reaches heights of six to eight feet, but it matures at just one foot wide. It's narrow enough to be useful and interesting, but dense enough to look good in a container. This evergreen is shade tolerant and hardy in zones five to seven. If you're looking for an evergreen to fill larger spaces, Spring Grove Thuya is the perfect choice. It's a fast growing, cold hardy selection of Western Arborvitae that shows excellent resistance to deer browsing. The tight pyramidal habit makes it an especially nice choice for creating fast growing privacy screens that will reach heights of 23 to 30 feet. But all hedges and screens need not be evergreen. Smooth and panicle hydrangeas make a fabulous flowering hedge, as does Forsythia and Wygilla. Look for old favorites like Incredible Smooth Hydrangea and Wine and Roses Wygilla, or try something new like Quick Fire Fab Panicle Hydrangea, which would create a wall of gorgeous color with its giant blooms that start out lime and transition to a watermelon pink. 